problem is on probability and now in this video we have to determine the probability for each of the following events a non defective bolt will be found if out of 600 bolts already examined 12 were defective see here we have to determine the probability for each of the following events a non defective bolt will be found if out of 600 total bolts are 600 already examined 12 were defective so the defective bolts are 12 so we have to determine the probability that a non defective bolt will be found if out of 600 and bolts already examined 12 were defective so we need a non defective bolt see here the total number of the bolts is 600 it is very clearly given that the defective bolts are 12 and the probability of defective bolt P of D is equal to 12 by 600. So, the probability of getting a defective bolt is 1 by 50. So, if I cancel with 12 table, that is 50, 1 by 50. And now see here, we need the probability of getting a non-defective. So, the probability of getting a defective bolt is 1 by 50. Now, the probability of finding a non-defective bolt is complement p of d complement so p of d complement is nothing but 1 minus p of d that is 1 minus probability of choosing a defective bolt 1 minus 1 by 50 which if i take 50 as lcm this is 50 minus 1 which is equal to 49 by 50 therefore the probability of getting a non-defective bolt out of 600 and volts is 49 by 50 and this is the answer see here <coughs> So now we have to determine the probability of each of the following events. A non-defective bolt will be found if out of 600 and bolts already examined 12 were defective. Total number of the bolts is 600. Defective bolts is 12. The probability of defective bolt is 12 by 600 which is equal to 1 by 50. So this is the probability of a defective bolt. Now the probability of non-defective bolt. See here a non-defective bolt is its complement that is p of d complement that is p of uh, d complement is equal to 1 minus p of t that is 1 minus 50 which is equal to 49 by 50 and this is how we have to solve thank you for staying till the end and have a look at my next video too it will be also very very helpful